Chapter 34 I woke up at the coffin the next day. Draco was gone. I got up and put on a black tight sex address that was all ripped at the end. There was a red corset going up the front and the back and it came up to my knees. There was a slit in the dress licking Mr. and Mrs. Mr. and Mr. Simth. I put on ripped black fishnets and black stilton boots. Suddenly, Saurius cocked on the door. I opened it. <laughs> Hi, Ebony. Okay, so this is... Wait. Is it si- Saurius? Is that meant to be Snape or, or Sirius Black, the, or, god for, yeah, the dog could father? Be. Could be the dog father. Because if it's Snape, in the last scene, Snape was about to, to rape them. Right? I think so, yeah. And he okay. was just trying to teach them a lesson. They got raped, and then he went. she went back in time to fuck the, Voldemort, right? Yeah. Okay. Because that would stop him from being evil. Guess what you have to come... Ge- guess what you have to come to Professor Sinister's office. Okay, I said in a depressed voice. I had wanted to fuck Draco, or maybe lesson to MCR or Evones- <laughs> Evonescence. I came anyway. So what the fuck happened to Snipe and Lupin? I asked Saurius flirtily. I fucking tortured them, he answered in a statistic way. <laughs> this, this statistical calculation with which these characters behave is off-putting. In a statistical way. They are in Azkaban now, lol. I laughed evilly. Where are Draco <laughs> and... <laughs> Where are Draco and Vampira, I muttered. They are excused from school today. Sodomize mode sexually. <laughs> now his name's Sodomize. Alright, we went from Sirius Black, the, the dog father, to, to Sodomize. Alright. Sodomize moaned sexually. Right now they are watching The Nightmare Before Xmas again. We went into the office. Professor Sinister was there. She's wearing a gothic black dress that was all ripped all over. It kind of looked like the one that Amy Lee wears in this picture. She took out the pensive and the time torner. Enemy! You will have to do another session now. Also, I need you to get me the cure for being addicted, she said loudly. <laughs> Good luck, fangs. And then, I jumped into the princive again. Suddenly, I looked around. I was in the great hall eating Count Chocula. It was morning. I was sitting next to Satan. On a table was a tall, gothic man with long black hair, pale skin and blue eyes, wearing a suit and black Converse shoes. He looked just like Charlie Manson. <laughs> Oh, fucking Charlie Manson, bro. I noticed he was drinking a portent. Who's he? I asked. Oh, that's Professor Slutborn, Satan said. He's the portent's teacher. Ebony? Yeah, I asked. Did you know that M- Marilyn Manson is playing in the Hogsmeade tonight? And they're showing the exercise at the movies before that. Yeah? Well, want to go to the contort and a movie with me? Chapter 35 ghost of you. Author's note. Thanks to Susie for the idea. You rock. Fuck off preps. Thanks to Raven for the help. You rock girl. P.S. I'm going to end destroy really soon so fuck you. Oh yeah and if you know any gothic names please tell me because I need one for serious. I'm really hesitating while I read this because I feel like I have to translate it from a different fucking language. Like, like what I'm saying is as close to an English version of what's written down as is possible. Oh, I don't think there is a direct English translation for most of these words. I went into the con men room, thinking of Satan. Suddenly I gasped. Draco was there. I grasped. He locked as hot as ever, wearing black leather pants, a black lonk and prack t-shirt, and black eyeliner. Draco, what the fuck are you doing? Dong, I gasped. Huh? He asked. Then I remembered. It wasn't Draco. It was Lucan. He still had two arms. Oh, hi, Lucian, I said. I'm Ebony, the new student, lol. We shook hands. Yeah, Satan told me about you, Lucian said. He pinted to a group of sexy gothic guys. They were sitting in a corner, cutting. It was serious. Vampire's dad. And snap! All of them were wearing black eyeliner and black good Charlotte band shirts. Listen, I'm a goth band with those guys, he said. We're playing tonight at the Marilyn Manson show as backup. 
Really, I asked? Yeah, he said. We're called X Black X Tier X. I play the gutter. Spartacus plays the drums, he said, pointing to him. Snap plays the boss, and James plays the guitar. To even foe, we call him Samuro, after Samurai in the ring. Hey, bastards, I told them. They gave me the death's touch sin. Suddenly, I gasped again. But don't you have a lead singer? I asked. Lucian looked down, sadly. We used to, but she did. She contempted suicide by slighting her rights. Oh my fucking god, that's so fucking sad, I gasped. It's okay, but we need a new lead snigger, Samuro said. Well, I said, <laughs> I'm in a bad myself. <laughs> really, asked Snape. I couldn't believe it. He used to be gothic. Yeah, we're called Bloody Gothic Rose 666. Do you want to hear me sing? Yeah, said everyone. So the guys took out their guitars. They began to play a song by, get it, because by guys are so sexy, <laughs> Gurn Day. <laughs> I, wa- I walk this empty strat on the Bolivrad of Broken Dreams. I sang sexily. I do not own the lyrics to that song. Everyone gasped. And up B, will you join the band? Plus, beg Lucian Samuro, serious and snap. Um, okay. I shrugged. Are we going to play tonight? Yeah, they said. Okay. I said I had... I knew that I had to get a new outfit. I wa- I <laughs> I wo- <laughs> oh, no! No! It gets, it gets worse. Okay. It, like, you think that it reaches the pinnacle of how bad it's going to get. And then it always finds new and exciting ways to surprise you with how shit it is. Okay, I said. But I knew I had to get a new outfit. I walked outside, wondering how I could go forward in time. Suddenly, someone jumped in front of me. <coughs> It was Morty McFly. <laughs> he was wearing a black band t-shirt and black beigey jeans. What the hell are you doing here? <laughs> I asked. I will help you go forward in time, NB. He said Baby seriously. Morty. Then he took out a black Tim machine. He went into it and suddenly I was forward in time. Oh my god. George, were you here when she called Marilyn Manson Charlie Manson? Please tell me you heard that part. <laughs> Charles Manson. Please tell me you heard the Charlie Manson bit. I did not. Check your Snapchat. I looked around in a depressed way. Suddenly, I saw Professor Sinister, Bloody Mary, Socrates, and Draco. <laughs> Alright, Socrates is here now. Oh, I don't Please fucking me. know where Socrates came from. Vampire and Willow were there too. OMFG, Sorius, I saw you and Samuro and Snip and everyone. I can't believe Snape used to be gothic. Yeah, I know, Sirius said sadly. Oh, hey that bitch, Professor Trevelry said in an emo voice, drinking some Voxamort serum. Hi, fucker, I said. Listen, <laughs> Satan asked me to... <laughs> Satan asked me out to a gothic... Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's perfect. Who expected a self-insert... From Marty McFly. No one could have anticipated a Marty McFly. Listen, Satan asked me out to a gothic concert and a movie, so I need a sex and new outfit for the date. Also, I'm playing in a gothic band, so I need an outfit for that too. Oh my, Satan. Get it, lol, because she's gothic. Gas bloody Mary. Want to go to Hot Topic to shop for your outfit? OMFS, let's have a group cutting session, said Professor Trevelry. What? Any reaction to that? I, either of you? No. no. Let's have a group cutting session. I yeah. can't fucking wait for that, but we need to get some stuff first, said Willow. Yeah, we need some portions for Professor Travelry so she won't be addicted to Volksamort serum anymore. And some love potion for Enerby. Dr- Darko said relu- reluctantly. <laughs> resultantly. <laughs> his name's Darko. Dra- his name is meant to be Draco. So Travelry's addicted Darko. to, like, Wizard Crack. <laughs> But it's called Voldemort Serum. Well, we have potions class now, Willow said, so let's go. We went sexually to potions class. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, no! (laughs) But Snap wasn't there. Instead, there was Cornelio Fuck. His last name is Fuck. (laughs) That's not even a spelling mistake, it's consistent. That's not a spelling mistake, it's cause... Hey, Cornelio when... Fuck. <laughs> That's our new character! <laughs> hey, where the fuck is Dobbledore? Draco shouted angrily. STFU shooted Cornelia Fuck. <laughs> He's in Azkaban now, with Snape and Lupin. He is old and weak, he has cancer. Now do your work. <laughs> 
Dumbledore and his Avril Lavigne cloak didn't, didn't teach at that school to get disrespected like that. Can you believe Snap used to be gothic, Vampire asked surprisingly. That's it, Cornelio Fuck shouted angrily. I'm getting Professor Bridge. He stomped out angrily. <laughs> Professor Bridge. <laughs> Professor Bridge and Cornelio Fuck. These are legitimately the best names I've ever seen in anything. I'm going to steal them for my A-level English coursework. He stomped out angrily. My friends and I began talking again. I began to drink some blood mixed with beer. Suddenly, I saw Hagrid in the cupboard. What the fuck is he doing here? I asked. Then I looked at Draco. He was wearing tons of eyeliner and he looked sexier than ever. Suddenly, Hagrid, what the fuck are you doing? He shouted. I looked around. Hagrid was putting something in my glass of blood. Dark one vampire started to beat him up sexually. God, you're such a poser, I shouted at Hagrid. Suddenly, I looked at what he was putting in the blood. It was amnesia portion. Okay, so Not Hagrid's trying portion. to date rape and be dementia way. For, for some reason. This Wait, one's start... amnesia portion, or? I, I, yeah, it was an amnesia potion. Oh, shit. This one says Darko's point of view at the beginning. So we're no longer following Enabi. We're now from, from Darko. Where's Diablo? I mean, Diabolo, by the way. Oh, you don't want to know. Diabolo right. don't even know. Darko's point of view. Lol. Vampire and I chained Hagrid to the floor. Oh, me fucking sake, Enabi said. Oh, she was so hot. Maybe I could use Amnesia Potion too, make Satan fall in love with me faster. But you are so sexy and wonderful anyway, Tata, said Vampire. Why would you need it? To make everything go faster, lol, said Enabi. But you won't have to... One second, guys. <laughs>